evening, thank you for joining us. Troops continue to work along the border in Nogales, putting up razor wire along the border fence. But the Nogales mayor is opposed to that razor wire. So much so that he is urging city council tonight to adopt a resolution telling the federal government to stop what it's doing. News 4 Tucson's Eric Fink is live in Nogales with more details. Eric, what can you tell us? Good evening, Angelique. That city council meeting here at City Hall has just started, and Mayor Arturo Garino, we just spoke to him a moment ago, and he says that concertina wire that's up now along the border fence is a type of wire you'd see in a battlefield-like setting or a war zone or in a prison. He says it is not the type of setting he wants to see in a city in downtown Nogales. Now, just a few days ago, the Trump administration sent more than 3,700 troops to border towns across the southwest to help put up the razor wire and help fortify these border towns. Mayor Garino says he's worried about the perception this will give the community's neighbors directly to the south. Garino argues this move by the federal government harms Nogales' biggest economic resource. He says that is the cross-border trade and business with Nogales Sonora. And we caught up just a few minutes ago with a husband and wife visiting from Michigan who are both alarmed by what they see. I don't believe that it's necessary on this side of the wall and to have razor wire. They already have a big wall. Why do they need something more? And back out here live tonight, we're going to head right inside to the council chambers and check in on the meeting. We will have much more on this story coming up tonight at 10 o'clock here from Nogales, including the council's decision. We are live this evening from Nogales City Hall. I'm Eric Fink, News 4 Tucson.